Hello, I hope this video finds you well. Tonight we are going to look at sum3 from list1, and this is the Python solution. This is a pretty straightforward problem. It's really just designed to ensure students have an understanding of lists and this idea of elements and indexes and simple math processes. So it says, given an array of ints length 3, return the sum of all the elements. So in this case, we see we have three elements. Indexes are 0, 1, 2. And so we say 1 plus 2 plus 3 is 6. 5 plus 11 plus 12 is 18. So this problem is as simple as saying return nums at 0 plus nums at 1 plus nums at 2. And that's it. And this is how you do this. Now, this is a precursor for a little bit more of a complicated version of this problem where perhaps we don't know the length of the list. And I'm going to write a solution this way because it highlights this really fundamental idea of lists and loops. And this applies to strings and loops as well. So if I want to find the sum of a list, I'm going to start by making a variable called sum and setting it to zero. And now I want to write that fundamental structure, a loop that looks at each index in a list. So I'm going to say for i in range. And because the indexes always start at zero, I'm going to start my loop at zero. And I want to go as long as i is less than the length of nums. And then we're going to increment by 1 each time. And then we'll say sum is equal to whatever's in the sum plus nums at i. And then I return the sum. And I hit go, and you notice that works as well. Again, in this case, this is total overkill because I know the lengths of 3, but a more realistic version of this problem is where the length could be any number. And that kind of highlights this fundamental structure, this idea of a loop that will look at every index inside of a list. I hope this helped. And again, you can always grab um, all my solutions with comments on my GitHub repository, which is linked in this video. Have a great day.